this is Two Minute Tuesday, and we're talking about those people that shout, it's all right, he's friendly. So there are two different angles that you can look at this from. Okay, firstly, if there is a dog in the park and he's on the lead, he's on the lead for a reason and he's gonna need some space. Either the dog is injured and is recovering from an operation or has just been spay or is in season um, or it could be a grumpy dog. Okay, so do yourself a favor, give them the space, okay? Make sure you avoid them, give them a nice wide curve and if your dog can't recall, i.e. come back from other dogs, then pop it on the lead the moment you see it, okay? Keep your dog entertained, playing games, feeding treats, get around the, the other dog, and then let your dog off for another run again, okay? Totally get it, 100%. However, there is a flip side to that coin. If your dog is super grumpy, uh, then don't take him to places where he's likely to bump into other dogs that are out of control. Um, it's a double-sided coin, okay? It's also your responsibility to make sure that A, you're taking them to places where you have some space to be able to work away from. Um, uh, and I say this because I have seen people taking dogs to parks, which are known for having lots of people walking their dogs, which are just not suitable to be in those parks. If that's your dog, uh, and I've been there myself, I've had those dogs before, um, it can be really hard, but it's also your responsibility to make sure that your dog doesn't make other people's dogs grumpy in the process. Listen, I'd love to hear your comments. Throw your comments in the comments section below. How many times can I say comments? Um, if you like the video, as always, please do give us a thumbs up, subscribe, share, uh, do all the things that you need to do uh, to make sure that we stay here giving you the content that you want to hear.